So I, I'm going to be doing a plan with me in my social media planner for the month of February. And I'm going to do the whole month of February in purple. Stick around to see why. Hi, I am Kate. Welcome to my channel, Planner Nerd Plans. I do monthly plan with me's, plan craft with me's, planner tips and tricks, and other things planner related, etc, etc, etc. Alright, so why I'm doing the my social media all purple is I got news recently watching one of Diamond and Pearl's live shows. Um, Purple Diva 66, she was part of the planner community, passed away. And Diamond would like us to do a plan with me for the first week of February in purple. And she also liked butterflies. So that is what I am doing. But I'm going to do the whole month like this. So I found some washi here and such for those. But also I have picked up all the, like I went through one side and picked up all the what I could see with a lot of purple stickers in it. Um, the reason being is in my social media one, I use a lot of boxes and checklists for this, but also I decorate in between. So we'll go there. Also, I before I get started on this, I have already planned out and got ready my health and my catch-all. So at the very end, stick around and you will see a flip through of those of what I've done. And also I'm going to show you something a little different here. Um, as I was decorating a whole month on my other planners, I've realized that once I saw a sticker that I could use for something, I went through all the weeks and I put that sticker down and such. And you'll see towards it here. Okay, so I need to find boxes to fit all of these. Yeah, so I need to find boxes to fit here and here. And I did on my last week here, but the thing is, is I've discovered that I can pre-set up a lot of my live shows and I just need to make them public and then they'll make be public. Um, and such. Alright, so let's go through and find some stickers here. I'm going to just start off with it that's on top and work my way down. Alright, let's get started here. I am doing a voiceover as I look for stickers here because it's faster for me to fast forward this and then talk over it for you guys. So I am looking, I remembered in this, um, the original Ron Wrong Everyday planner that there is these stickers that would fit in the calendar here so I'm looking for that and then also I'm trying to find I like to use these half boxes here because they're perfect even though they're a little smaller than a, for the other part but they're a little bit small for the calendar boxes um, I'm going to do the wash. <laughs> You'll see me do random stuff here because I'm just trying to um, make this a little bit quicker so it's not an hour long video for you guys. Okay, so I'm finding more boxes here. The thing is, is I'm laying down, going through these sticker books, and every time I see a sticker that I want to play in a certain spot, I will do so. So that's why I have the whole month out because then I'll be flipping through them. But right now I'm just trying to find stickers for the monthly. Um, where I'm putting these stickers are of course the two t times a week that I go or have videos. One is live show on Mondays and the other one on Thursdays is my actual uploaded videos. So I pulled out some stickers from her Casa Planner. I believe I have her link below, so check that out. Um, she does planner stickers, and also if you're part of HB90 uh, goal planning, she also has some of those stickers as well. So I'm trying to use up some of my stickers here. Um, I saw that I had a little bit of leftover of Viv Von Alley's um, film and edit ones, so. I'll show you the website there and also she's linked below so I'm putting those down just on the two days that I try to 
get this done. I, I haven't really got into batch recording yet. Um, as such, I hope to soon. Um, it's one of those things, it's been really hard to get down a good groove for me. I have a lot I want to get done with my planner shop, but at the same time, I still want to keep up on this because I'm enjoying to do, doing these videos as well. So, I am looking for what I'm trying to figure out. What am I doing? <laughs> okay, so I'm going to start looking for here is because I have these uh, Facebook and um, YouTube stickers to use up. So I'm going to start putting them all out for each week. Um, I, did, I realized too late because this is a purple theme for Purple Diva 66 that I could have used all those purple once and be done but instead I just went down like my normal what Kate does is like okay we're just going down and using all the colors we're not singling out I just I didn't get into the brain of it until later so I ran out of the Facebook ones for the last one I still have to go through my stash to see if I can find any other social media it could be Facebook or um, Instagram I do the same thing to both and so now I'm trying to find some checklists and I'm going back at first I thought I was going to, no no I have to go back to the beginning so I have a lot of checklists on these weeklies um, I put every single task that I put for my YouTube videos so I'm doing this helps me remember all the little steps because they're all important so I have five on this side and then I have three on the other but also I have two boxes to remind me to keep an eye out on things when I released videos so I am going through I think this one is the colorful boxes that I'm going through and finding all the purple and blue the reason I'm getting putting a little bit of blue in here is because the washi tape that I have has a little bit of blue. I'm going to do the washi tape towards the end of setting this up. Right now I'm just getting all my essentials basically as I'm calling it. The checklist and so forth. After I was done with this I was kind of regretful that I didn't cover up those three colored lines and did something different. Um, I don't know if it's too late to but we'll see. I have some skinny washi that will fit there and it's a work in progress this one especially when I have a theme like this to do purple it anything it can be I'll talk I say talk about this more later but anything oh and I decided nah we're gonna put this underneath it doesn't look good on top <laughs> oh and so this is the everyday run wrong regular ones I saw that they had some checklists that I've never used see I don't usually use these type of checklists for my catch-all. My catch-all I use boxes mostly. But checklist I have since I have so many things for doing my videos, sharing it and such, sharing my experience that um, I realize I'm starting to use up all my checklist here. So uh, Okay, so I guess I was flipping through. I'm trying to find, I found one here that matched. The other colors didn't match, and I used up all the rest. And this is the new productivity one. It has a lot of functional stickers in it, but apparently I was, and I was debating about using boxes, and I just said, nah. So as we transition, I'm looking through one of the student ones here from last year. I'm really trying to use up my stickers. So I found one, and it's interesting, like that one's a smidge shorter than the other ones. Don't know why. I like all these different sizes ones. I realized I could not use the mini checklist. So I was like, nope, never mind. So I know this kind of looks very dark in a sense of like a dark blue, this last color of the colorful, or no, not the colorful, the rainbow sticker book from Happy Planner but it, it's actually more of a dark purple don't worry I fixed that I, I just need to lay it down so then I had an idea of how long they were because 
as you can see, all these checklists are different sizes. And such. All right. Oh, I got found more. Uh, so this is the wrong, wrong book. The newest one. I think I got it from Hobby Lobby. And I haven't used it. So I'm like, wait, let's, I have another wrong, wrong everyday book. So I pulled the checklist purple ones from there. So basically that's what I'm doing is I'm going through all the books that I can see have purple on on the back and find those checklists. And I realized when I was doing this earlier with my catch-all, going through one book at a time, pulling all the stickers I know I'm going to use and put them down. But sometimes I do is like, I'm him and hawing. Like, see, I saw here on the um, new wrong wrong book that I haven't used these time with friends stickers. And so I wanted to put those down for my live shows. And then I think later on you'll see, and maybe. So I find those are like, okay. I, so that's what I've been doing lately is stopping what I'm doing. I don't focus on each week I'm like okay I have enough for okay let's do this for all the weeks let's do this for all the weeks you know it's got kind of that made it finish so I continue the search through all my sticker books this is of course the wellness one old one older one a year ago so so because it has a lot of purple in it I've been pulling through and making sure I get all the purples Still on the hunt for more stickers. This is the last week. And I believe I may have, yeah, I find one more in this Free Spirit purple one, I call it. It has more purples in it. So I think I found one in here that I was able to lay down, but then I couldn't find any more purples in my sticker books. So I went and found some boxes for the last two checkbox, last two checklist. <laughs> And of course the sunshine decides to peek through and then I fixed it <laughs> and yeah so I picked up and then also I realized I needed to find boxes and then these boxes here I guess they were for the calendar part I'm assuming because they're a little bit wider than the columns here but I was like okay whatever I'm just gonna put it down and then I used I realized oh yeah I need to go to those um, I'm starting to really, this wrong, wrong, everyday original one is starting to get really bare. So I need to go through it and put it in the, the other sticker book and see what I can transfer over and such like that. Um, I'm really tempted with my sticker books so I can see them all because I didn't realize I had more trash stickers. I didn't realize I had more trash stickers until someone pointed it out to me on Monday. I was like... Oh, yeah, Kate should go through her stickers more and figure out what she has and doesn't have. <laughs> but I do have kicks, sticker kits. Um, a lot from uh, also in Simply Gilded. So I'm here, I'm just going to write down. This is the only writing I do, you guys, because I didn't want to bore you with all the writing of the list that I do. It's repetitive. It's the same thing over and over. So don't forget to check out my... Um, Instagram and my Facebook page and I will show all the pages with all the writing and you were probably going to go oh my gosh and then any other ad stickers I was just after doing sticker hunting for an hour looking for all the purple stickers to get everything I needed for this uh, spread for the month it was a lot and I was like starting to get tired so I was like okay Let's, well, so this is very minimal decorative per se. I'm putting all the bottom washi down here. It has butterflies, what purple diva 66 
apparently loved butterflies. I don't have a lot of butterfly things, so this was luckily my butterfly washi. The other butterfly washi I had was not purple, so I was like, nope, we gotta do the purple and blue ombre with butterflies for her. So, and then I kept this little quote down here, give me more, give me all the flowers. But you'll see later, I decide, since it's pink, I kind of wrote over it in purple to highlight it. So I'm starting to decorate because I think I got all my list, all my boxes that I need for my list and my reminders. And I really enjoyed doing the vertical layout compared to the horizontal layout last year. I think with the vertical layout, I'm able to write more list. I don't know why. And reminders for each day. So it's very... How do I describe it? It's very, I don't know, it feels more organized and it works with my brain. I cannot do horizontal, unfortunately. Um, so I'm going through and I do the purple, that's a purple washi with gold hearts on it. And then here's the rest, this ombre here. I didn't realize it had pink in it. I'm like, oh well, um, it's a purplish pink. But I started put this was part of the same, um, monthly box of Simply Gilded with the butterflies. So that's why I picked it to highlight that. But also I still need that sidebar for stats. And that's what I write in a lot is on the side there I do stats. And I had to scooch that out. I put it too far down. But here we go last week. I didn't really like this sticker, but the newer colorful boxes there, I was trying to explain. I don't like how they split it up in three, but they do have in this colorful boxes book, these purple flowers. So I'm decorating, putting one on each week, and I'm trying to put them in different spots throughout. And that's me just talking to you. And I'm like, this is when I said, screw it. I'm, yeah. I was telling you like all about how these pretty flowers I'm making one each but when I started editing that's why I started doing that voiceover all right so here's the last week um, I'm trying to think of any so I'm flipping through that's too big flipping through and then I saw these quotes on the back and some of them are purple so I started taking them out here and I think there was enough for each week and just putting them in where I don't usually put lists this is list parts like Friday and Saturday is a lot of where my decorating and the, the bottom there for um, my social media planner I don't have a lot there sometimes I do I did a little too much decorating last month so this time I was kind of that's why I was kind of hesitant to decorate a whole lot because in those other boxes if there's something I need to do or remember I will put it there um, so I'm going through here seeing if I want to find any Heather, head, oh my gosh, header stickers for the two boxes. Um, just because I think it's great to use those for those things. Oh, and here we go. I found these purple hearts and I just put one on each. Week. Bam, just a little something, something. And then let's see here. Oh, I went to the um, free spirited book, and I remember they had purple flowers in there, and I had one little one left, and I put it up there. So it's very minimal planning here, but I'm trying to look through to see if there's anything decorative in all my purple planners. I didn't want to use those flowers. Um, I'm trying to see if there's anything. I'm flipping through here. So here I go, putting the paper mint flare purple over those words so they make them a little bit more purple for the spread. And I color in the flowers. And then, oh yes, this is when I remember the wrong, wrong minis. I always like to use the minis. I don't use a mini planner, but I get the mini stickers because they're perfect size for the monthly. 
So I put time with friends stickers there and then later I'll write my live show. I was looking through here to see if there's anything that popped out. All right, so I got this back on the rings and then I realized, wait, there's this purple days of the week I have washi from Simply Gilded. So I was trying to think, oh, it's too big for the, because how is all the different colors at top? I was like, oh, it's too big. Okay, it's maybe the colorful boxes because I saw they had Monday through Friday in there. Nope, it's not all purple. It's all different random colors. So I said, okay, it fits on the weeklies. That's what I was trying to determine there. And I started widening them out and I put this down for covering that. I might do here later. I am still up in the air about it. It just depends on how much time and energy I want to decorate. But I will probably, maybe, possibly, um, color in those numbers up top with a paper map flare. So I put these guys down. Then I realized, hey, I can do the whole strip and just line it up. <laughs> and this is when I realized also I should have whitened out those bottom lines and put a thinner washi down there, which I might, might not do. Like I said, after an hour, over an hour and a half working on this, I was basically done. My brain was done. I was tired. So it happens sometimes on your spreads when you're doing a whole month. Um, easily, sometimes when I have a lot of energy, this will take me two, three hours um, to do. I know it's a lot of time, but it just depends on what you want to do. Sometimes you have to go down to just getting the bare bones down and decorate throughout the time you use it as well. Um, that's what I did with my catch all this last January is I decorated as I go. Okay, we're almost done here and I'll let you in with the rest of this video. Here we go. So I was hoping to find something to cover the date, so the week up here, but this is way too thick. As you can see, it'll be covering up the number in uh, February there. So do that. Um, the rest of this I will fill in with pen, um, especially my lives at four Pacific time, um, and then my sidebars and my checklist I will f all these little reminders that I have put here I didn't find any more purple stickers but I will go through my what do you call it? break apart fall apart sticker book sticker books I've made these are all happy planners that the happy planner sticker books that fall apart on me and so I stick them in here or they need to condense down and this is basically so I need to go through here to see if there's anything quote wise or anything like that. I didn't want to waste you guys' time in doing so. But if I come across something, I will do such. But I was glad I came across this uh, Simply Gilded washi tape. I didn't ever use it. Even though it's hologram, it's okay. I think hologram is the most neutral um, foil out there. You can use it any, for any of the colors. So I did that. I will, since these are actually, looks like I can color in the numbers, I will kind of color them in with my paper mate flares here. Probably most likely the dark purples to offset the light purple, but you can tell it took me a while to find the right stickers. And of course, towards the end, I found some boxes that have their to-do list. And I do that sometimes. If I don't have the right sticker, I'll do that. So keep an eye out on my Instagram and you will see the finished all of these lists filled out or something and such all right so now i'm going to about to start showing you a flip through of my capsule and my health planner so here's the february section of my health planner um the reason why it looks so loose like this is because levenger has put a little extra ump um in their mushroom that it's easy to transition and that's what I like about the Levenger punch. Alright, so I tried to think 
purple is the thing. This was way before um, a diamond show, but it happened to be such. But I was kind of like, it was more, I put all my Oso paper stickers down, and then afterwards I was trying to figure out, okay, which kit I'm going to use. I couldn't decide, so I was like, okay. So I started going through that sticker book, which has all the little things on it. So I put, she's starting to put um, holiday stickers and so forth on her monthly packet. So last month I got that, and then I just started using up all these random dot stickers in my basically sticker graveyard but instead I reuse them so and then when I went through to go look for stickers I was like oh this is a good washi for it so I put that washi down it is a smidge too big for my margins here um and such so I am trying to debate if I need to when I design the next years do I need to shift this down or not but at first I was picking out purplish Coat stickers are pink because at first it was pinkish and then I found these unicorns that were both pink and purple so that's when the purple got tied in with the pink um, no this is not tracking food but I'm not gonna use them for anything else <laughs> so they're, they're, they're there I usually can tell it's very random because I was just going through the book and pulling all this little stickers that hold here and then towards the end here I was looking for all the little hearts and just stuff so and then of course that's when the unicorns came into play for the rest of it in the hearts my husband's like are we are having a unicorn thing going on i'm like i'm just trying to use these things up <laughs> that is all all right next is the catch-all okay so this is my february catch-all section and pink was the theme because i had this pink washi with the hearts and then i found it was mostly based off of this washi uh, whatever kit. So I was like, okay, found a similar, maybe it's a floral, but also I was trying to use up um, some washi. And here is this. Here's the first week. All pink. I was going through, like I said, this is all part of a theme together and so I just pulled it and then I just pulled other random stickers um, the dinner plans are not exact but I make three dinners a week one we go out and the rest are leftovers or easy food like frozen pizza and stuff but it changes from week to week I try to do that I have my cluster of whatever stickers were in different parts um, I made sure every week had a spot for top three to do's and such in here I'll put it in between all this um, I wanted to do this because lately as a family every Saturday we've been cleaning it's not all on me it's the kids and my husband and everything so I just like okay here's so it's like downstairs upstairs downstairs upstairs so then we get our stuff done and laundry so this is just very full with stickers the yellow got tied in because this theme had those yellow stickers so it didn't bug me but um i found some my watering plant stickers i always water my plants on wednesdays for my oh so kick i think she's discontinuing it and i'm just like I need your functional stickers again <laughs> oh so paper i want all like your water one again the way you know the step ones again um i'm just like I'm hoping that she'll bring them back but in a different style or something and here is the last one so I did my best um, I really liked it how it worked out this time and also I don't know if you noticed this it was on purpose I shifted the stickers as well just a smidge still looks like it's mainly here but it was not I didn't want to be cookie cutter going everything has to stay within its color within the lines I do not want to color within the lines that's what I'm thinking of so I shifted things over I created grouping stickers of certain things that's happened with the smaller stickers I do looking for more of those I don't want them this big but I will take it um I'm phasing out of happy planner stickers 
I'll still use them. I'm going to use them all up. Um, I have plenty of those ones. Plenty, of, you know, I will have, I have plenty in the sense of those chores, but, um, I do have plenty of my little laundry basket and laundry stickers, but I'm trying to think in a sense, um, you know, all these, maybe, I don't know. I'm trying, I'm thinking out of the head here. Um, I'm almost like used up all, like if you do a color theme like this, as you can discover with the purple, <laughs> you either have an abundance of or not enough. So pink was no problem. And that's why I chose pink for my catch all for Valentine's month is because of all this. Now, after just the being in two months in a row, working on my own inserts, these inserts, I don't know if I'm really bad telling you guys especially those who are the first time watching my videos. And I do apologize, but this is not a strength of mine and I'm working on it. These inserts from my catch-all and my health planner um, are my own inserts. The shop is Douglas for Planner Co. and it's down below. I do disc bounds and rings and I do have a few coils for those who don't want to customize, but the point of my shop is to have more customizable. I will punch them with this lavender, lavender punch. You don't have to worry about punching it yourself unless you put a note to me in your order. I think I have it where you can say don't punch. I will not punch it. You can punch it if you want, but I figured it's easier for me to punch and get it out there and then, and then you can, you know, it works out for you. Um, start adding things I was trying to do uh, the three the two pink ones and the red one that I was going through here I put Valentine's Day and it, oh yeah President's Day I think Tuesday is Mardi Gras day this week but I don't have a Mardi Gras one so um, there's that so basically I planned for my top threes for the Monday through Friday but also um, just color you know I guess more decorative than I used to and I, I'm really enjoying this that I have the freedom now to shift these however I want it it's okay that they shift over I don't have to white out a thick line but probably next year I will print myself a black a grayscale copy because uh, this blue is not quite matching with the pink <laughs> it is what it is but it's one of those things for those who are you know simplest it, it's an it's an, a great idea but in this sense I'm kind of going mm, I like to see things quarterly match so it's still him and hawing um, I have a lot of date stickers so I could easily you know cover this line with washi and for so forth but anyways I think that works yeah I think that works so um thank you for sticking around this long for with me on my plan with me for my monthly plan with me i hope you give me a thumbs up let youtube know with that thumbs up that you enjoyed this video also don't forget to subscribe if you're new and please let me know if i didn't describe where i got it from or mention it or anything like that i am welcome to the conversation below in the co comments below just nothing rude i think that's it so don't forget to check out the videos at the end that I've I I put the video at the end here. I always select what's best for the viewer from my videos. And other than that, I will see you on those next videos.